Record greenhouse gas levels helped bring temperatures to an all-time high in 2024, the UN weather body said on Wednesday, accelerating glacier and sea ice loss, raising sea levels and edging the world closer to a key warming threshold. Annual average mean temperatures stood at 1.55 degrees Celsius or 2.79 degrees Fahrenheit above pre-industrial levels last year. Countries agreed in the 2015 Paris Agreement to strive to limit temperature increases to within 1.5 degrees Celsius above the 1850 to 1900 average. The number surpasses the previous 2023 record by 0.1 degrees Celsius, the World Meteorological Organization said in its annual climate report. John Kennedy, the lead author of the WMO report, explains its significance. One thing to kind of point out very clearly is that one single year above 1.5 degrees wouldn't mean that the level mentioned in the Paris Agreement had been formally exceeded. Uh, the Paris Agreement is usually taken to refer to long-term averages, um, some kind of multi-year or even multi-decadal average of temperature. So one year doesn't exceed that. But he says uncertainty ranges in the data means it cannot be ruled out. The report said other factors could also have driven global temperature rises last year, including changes in the solar cycle, a massive volcanic eruption and a decrease in cooling aerosols. Extreme weather wreaked havoc across the globe, with droughts causing food shortages and floods and wildfires displacing 800,000 people, the highest since records began in 2008. Ocean heat also reached its highest on record and the rate of warming is accelerating, with rising ocean CO2 concentrations also driving up acidification levels. Glaciers and sea ice continued to melt at a rapid rate. Here's oceanographer Karina von Schuchmann. As a consequence of a warming ocean um, and also as a consequence of melt from land ice, the ocean sea level is rising. So you can see here of an estimate from satellite altimetry starting in 93 up to 24, there is a continued increase in sea level. And in 24, the global mean sea level reached a record high in the satellite record. So from 2015 to 2024, the sea level rose at an annual rate of 4.7 millimeters, and is compared to a value of 2.1 millimeters from 1993 to 2002. The report authors state the long-term implications of the melting ice can affect the overall circulation of the oceans, which affects the climate around the world.